Kids love time on tablets, right? But the screen time we're talking about this morning can be life changing. It's new technology doctors say could help diagnose autism more quickly and accurately. 11 Lives Liza Lucas joins us with more. Liza, this new tool already making a difference at Children's Healthcare of Atlanta. Yeah, this is really fascinating technology we're talking about this morning because we know it can sometimes take months, even years to get an official autism diagnosis. A normal evaluation can take up to six hours and there are just not enough clinicians to go around. So this new tool could cut down time to diagnosis and Children's Marcus Autism Center is the first in the nation to use this type of technology. Here is how it works. Kids as young as 16 months watch videos of social interactions on a tablet. They don't know it's a test, but the scenes help clinicians know whether or not kids are paying attention to key information that's really typical for their developmental age. That tool is capturing thousands of data points in a matter of minutes. We're typically developing children watching those scenes of social interaction. Every moment is a way that they try to solve what's happening in front of them and understand what's the most important content to look at. You know, doctors always say the sooner kids get support, the better they do. So Liza, early intervention is the goal. Any idea how much this new technology might speed up a diagnosis? Yeah, Cheryl, parents usually start to notice kids missing milestones around the age of two, but doctors say kids are sometimes not diagnosed until they are four or five. So that's a really critical window you mentioned. The hope is this new technology can be an objective measure to speed up the process and get kids and families much faster support. All right, one in 36 kids in the U.S. has autism. This could help a lot of families. Liza, thank you.